Now, the UN is warning of a bleak future for children's education in northern Nigeria due to an increasing number of attacks on schools. Now, an armed group abducted 287 students along with a teacher in the town of Koriga in Kaduna State on Thursday. Mustafa Abubakar is one of the students who managed to escape the mass abduction. Here's his story. My name is Mustafa Abubakar. We saw a bandit on a motorbike. That did not seem strange. We have seen some of them ride through the village before. Shortly after, more than a hundred appeared, firing indiscriminately. They were shooting at us, herding us like cattle, beating, threatening, and marching us till we reached a river where we drank water and continued. That water was our breakfast. Some of us did not eat breakfast before coming to school. The injured and the sick were put on motorbikes instead of letting them return home. Suddenly, a military aircraft appeared overhead and they quickly pushed us under a tree, threatening to kill us all. They offered us three oranges. Imagine, three oranges for all of us. We gave them to the youngest among us. They said they had studied the village for three days before they struck, but their target was the security forces. I found a bush where no one was looking. I hid in there for an hour. When I was sure they were gone, I walked for hours till I came upon a scared old man. I finally reached a group of loggers who were oblivious to all that was happening. 